Okay, hey everybody, this is Greg Ryder. Welcome to this week's uh, training and this our mastermind training. And our goal is to empower you with information, knowledge, tools, tactics, strategies that can help you succeed. So we're going to dive right into it to what I call Success Mastery Secrets. I do want to give a shout out to Brian Tracy. I learned this from Brian Tracy and he did give me permission to use this to share and teach to other people. So that's what this is all about. So the question we want to ask ourselves is what is the most highest paid work you do? The most valuable, the most highest paid things that you can do is thinking. It's, it's about you spending the time and actually allocating time, putting it on your calendar to brainstorm and to think about what actions you can take that can provide the best value for what you're doing. And the reason why thinking is so important and is the highest paid work you do is because the thinking dictates the actions you take and the actions you take create the consequences. And the consequences is what we need to control. Once we can control our consequences, we can really control our income and what you're doing. And so Kevin says you're breaking up. Am I still breaking up, Kevin, or am I, am I still going good? I saw that question come in. If I'm sounding okay. Ah, Steven says I'm sounding good. Okay. So we'll keep going. So what is your most valuable financial asset? Like, let me ask you guys. Go ahead, type in the, the chat box. This is going to be real interactive. What is the, your, most your most valuable financial asset? What do you think that is? Let me see if I can get some feedback here. Your mind, your list, your home. Those are all good answers. But here's your most valuable financial asset. It's your earning ability. Your knowledge, which is your expertise, and your earning ability. That is your most valuable financial asset. You can lose your house, you can lose everything else, but you, once you learn and, and how to create money and how to earn money, that ability you can never be taken away. That is your most valuable financial asset. Why? Because it's your ability to get results. Right? So the more you learn and the fact that you're spending time listening to me right now and the fact that you're taking energy out of your time, you're obviously putting value into this and that's what our goal is to give you more information, more knowledge, little, anything that can trigger something, that can do something for you, that can help you be, uh, make more money, earn more money and get better results. It's, just, it's really good stuff. So what is the best investment of your time and money? You have to increase your what? Your earning ability. Right? So. We want you to increase your earning ability. That's simple because that's the best investment of your time and your money is to increase your earning ability, and that's through knowledge and education. So what is the most important part of today, right? Let's talk about that. It's the action you take after today, after you listen to me, after you learn this stuff, and after you do this. That is the most important thing of today is the action you take every day. Right, and so we all want to be leaders. We all want to make more money. We want to increase our earning ability. We want to think more and think better. And and leadership is action. It's not a position. Right. So, again, if you're going to lead your family, if you're going to lead your business, if you're going to lead your team, it's about the action you take, not necessarily the title or the position of leadership. So we want you want you to increase your leadership and to do that. You have to always ask yourself, what is my next action? You, you have to always continually ask yourself and get into that thinking process and be asking yourself, what is my next action? And that's all about prioritization. It's all about saying no. It's all about um, being sequential in your thought process. And then the other thing you have to do is you have to develop a sense of urgency. Right? If you think that you can just be lazy and put things off, I'll get that to tomorrow, you're not going to move that ball forward. Things aren't going to happen the way you want them to happen. And so you've got to... Um, develop that sense of urgency. And really there is no limits to what you can accomplish when you unlock the power of your mind. And I really want you guys to think about this and if you want to Google it and put some more energy into it, but thinking really is your best asset. And I am one of these guys that I spend too much time doing and not enough time thinking. So that was one of the reasons I wanted to kind of go through this teaching is because I'm teaching to myself. I love to do. I love taking action. I love seeing the ball being moved forward. But a lot of times you got to step back, allocate the time, think about what you're doing, think about what's next, and then put things in the proper sequence and say no to things that don't have a high impact on what you're trying to accomplish. So. As an action item, one of the things I'd like you guys to do is just get a pencil and paper out right now and based on that short little training of thinking and leadership and, and action and consequences, uh, 
what's the one action that you can take immediately once we get done with this call that will immediately affect a result of what you've learned so far? Like, what is that action? And if you, something comes to mind and just flips in your head and you want to type it in the chat box, you can go ahead and do that too. But the goal is to kind of write something down going, okay, um, you're going to think more. You're going to allocate some time for thinking more. You're going to prioritize your tasks more. Um, you're going to, you're, what, what is it that you're going to do based on what you just learned? And for me, uh, with what we have going on with Slurry Lifestyle Brands and T-Rex, the opportunity is everywhere. There's so much opportunity. We really have to start saying no more. And we really got to think through the best course of action and we got to put that course of action in writing and set those goals and then we got to execute on those goals and say no to anything that gets away with those goals so you could do the same thing like what I need to do so along those lines let's talk about it what we refer to as a thief a achievement thinking this is seven key thinking tools to achieve maximum results number one clarity so in my investment banking days, and, and Ed and Jeff, my business partners who are listening in, we talk to entrepreneurs on a daily basis and have for years and years and years. And the one thing that we find with every entrepreneur is the ones that have clarity are the ones that are being successful and the ones that don't have clarity are the ones not being successful. So wherever you are with your T-Rex business and your online store, if you don't have clarity of who your audiences are going to be, what your products are going to be, how you're going to do what you're going to do, what you're doing, you're not going to make money. You're not going to be as effective. So the first goal is, and the first you know, critical step to being successful is start to get clarity right and write your clarity down write it down in written form your values your mission your purpose your goals right what are you trying to do how are you trying to do it ask yourself could there be a better way that's a great question that especially if you have a team and a, and 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 and, a, and, a, and a, a employees or partners or whatever you get into a room you start you break Talk, talk about one issue and go, is there a better way to do this? Is there a more efficient way to do this? So like Randy and I at Printex, we're talking about this every day. Is there a better way to make flow more more efficient? Uh, is there a better way to get the orders out? Is there a better way to uh, systemize this? With T-Rex, you know, now that we've taken control and we own T-Rex, we're putting systems and things in place to so it's better. And it's, it's going to function better. It's going to be better for everybody. And so it's very, very important you do that. And then what you want to do is you want to practice what uh, Brian Tracy calls zero-based thinking in everything. And zero-based thinking is start from zero. Don't take any preconceived notions into your thought process. Don't take any preconceived notions into what you're thinking and how you do it and what you do. If you can start from zero, especially as a team and in a mastermind type situation, you really can get out of the box thinking, get creative what you do, and you'll notice that, especially in the online you know, apparel sales business, you'll see the people that are really making money, they're really creative in their thinking, and they're really creative in, in how they use everything from trust message to T-Rex to the opt-in builder to the, to the survey plug-in to you know, the video remix to um, I saw a training uh, this morning on uh, how to find niche buyers. It was really kind of cool. But you always want to start from a zero-based thinking in everything you do. Okay, so number two of the seven, competence requires excellent performance at the business of the business task, right? So a lot of times I'm doing things that, that really is not my competency. And sometimes I'll struggle through them and I'll get them done. And then other times I'll bite the bullet, I'll hire the right person, I'll outsource to the right person, and I'll get a much better result as well as I'll get that stress out of my life. So think about that. What are you doing that you shouldn't be doing? And one of my friends used to always say, if it's not your genius, it's not your job. So think about what is your competitive advantage? What do you do well? What are you what are you good at? What should you be doing? What are your areas of excellence? And what is your articulated sales argument? Now again, this isn't really applicable to the t-shirt marketing and stuff, but from a business perspective, uh, I have a whole other program I teach called Monopolize Your Marketplace. And we've been teaching small businesses for years. And what we talk about is people sometimes call it the unique selling proposition. I call it the articulated sales argument. And the articulated sales argument is kind of like you're the lawyer and you got to present your case to a judge and a jury, and you got to present such overwhelming evidence that you evidence that you are the person to do business with, that they would be a fool to do business with anybody else but you. That's the ASA, the articulated sales argument. So you think about that kind of stuff, and it's just great stuff for building your business, making you guys unique, and making you share what's going on. 
Number three, constraints. So identify what's holding you back. One of the greatest gifts uh, a businessman can understand is what is keeping you from doing what you know you should be doing? What is keeping you from pro to procrastinate? What is keeping you from taking those steps? What is keeping you from moving things forward? What are those constraints? Is it I don't have a webmaster? Is it I don't have a designer? Is it I don't have an assistant? Is it I don't have a fast computer? If I don't have fast internet? You know, there's all these different things that I use these excuses all the time and you do too. So if we identify those, it's going to help us move through those blocks and get to the next thing. Because the constraint is what sets the speed at which you achieve your goals. Mm -hmm. And once you can eliminate constraints, you'll speed up your achievement, speed up the achievement of your goals, which is what we all want, right? So that's, that's pretty stuff. So then you have to ask yourself, or what are the limiting factors on results? What are limiting my fat? What are the limiting factors that get on my results? What's limiting to me to get better results? Is it my audience? Is it my ads? Is it my pictures? Is it my images? Is it my designs? And you know, one of those things I heard the other day, and again, I'm new to the T-Rex and all the T-shirt marketing a little bit, but one of the things I heard is we're really not in the T-shirt business, we're in the design business, because designs is what sell. And you know, maybe combine that with emotions and stuff, but what is that limiting factor? So if you address these constraints and what's slowing you down and what your limiting factors are and you articulate them and write them down, then and only then can you address those and create solutions to those through your thinking process and then your thinking process leads to actions. And then apply the 80-20 rule to your situation. You know, internally 80% of your business is internally and externally is 20 percent. So you need to think about that 80-20 rule and, and how it affects everything you're doing and let's start to work on the 20 percent of the stuff that gets us 80 percent of the results. Like if you go into any business you'll find that 80 per, 20 percent of the actions generate 20, 80 percent of the money. It's really kind of interesting how that happens but it is what it is. So that's number three. Number four, creativity. So you got to tap into your creativity, tap into, I should say into, your ability to find faster, better, cheaper ways to do things. Faster, better, cheaper, more, pro, you know, better ways to do things. And with the internet, with our, with our community, our Skype group and our Facebook group, we can ping things off other people within the community, we can share ideas. And one of the things I, I'd like to request everybody to do, when you come up with a great aha moment or a great ideas or some creativity, I want you to write them down, put them in a little notepad, and when we have these calls, I'm going to open up for Q and A at the end. You, we want, I want you to share it. I, I would like to build a community where we all share our best ideas and our best practices with others, with the intention that if we help enough people get what they want, we'll get what we want, and if we help each other, we're going to we're going to move that ball down the. The, you know, to the goal line a lot faster and we're going to increase our speed, we're going to get rid of the constraints and we're going to do all this stuff. So in order to do that, define the problem or your goal clearly, then ask what else is the problem, right? So if, when, when you're trying to get creative, you know, this is a creative step, right? Number four is first define the problem you're having and, you know, we talked about a few minutes ago, then ask yourself what else is the problem? 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 And you keep going down that road. You keep coming up with all these problems. It really starts to create and get the creative juices going in the room as you're articulating the problem to identify all the solutions. So then you go, okay, what is the possible solution? What is the possible solution? Then ask yourself, what else is the solution? What else is the solution? What else is the solution? And don't just be, uh, don't just stop with asking yourself one time. What what else is the solution? Ask yourself and brainstorm and spend some time thinking about what these solutions are, and 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 let the creativity and all that ingenious come out of you. Um. So let's talk about defining the goal problem as a question. So that's the other thing too. When you have a goal or you have a problem, try to define it as a question. And then what you want to do is you want to develop 20 answers to the question. And this kind of goes back to copywriting and headline creation. It's like we're spending time to address the issues that we need to address so we can be successful at what we're doing. Select one answer and then take immediate action. So if you could, if you could ask it as a question, then create 20 answers to the question, then try to prioritize those answers and what you think is going to have the best result and speed things up, take one answer and take action on it. Number five, concentrate. Focus your talents and resources where exceptional results are possible. 
So this is really, really important that we try to identify what's going to have the biggest and most impact, the biggest impact on what you're trying to do. So when you can define your greatest opportunities and you determine your most valuable resources and you decide upon your best talents and skills and you concentrate on those areas and putting those to work, and if, you, and if you're weak in those areas, you, you identify people that you can put on your team that are strong in those areas, this is the kind of stuff that's going to help you get to where you want to go and speed up those end results and eliminate those frustrations and that kind of stuff. I hope that makes sense. Number six, continuous learning. Obviously, you're on this call. You're, you, 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 you value continuous learning. I do as well. So we want to continue to upgrade our knowledge and skills on a regular basis. Um, you know, uh, my, my, one of my mentors, uh, Charlie Tremendous Jones, said you will become the books you read and the people you hang out with. And, you know, everyone says you should read 30 to 60 minutes a day. I personally don't care for reading. Reading puts me to sleep, but I listen to audio books. And so I listen to audio books um, every day. Attend seminars, conferences, and webinars four times a year and listen to audio in your car. We all know that, right? Number seven. Courage. So I want to commend everybody for being on this call and being a customer of ours because it does take courage to you know run your own business and to do everything you want to be on, on your own. And the fact that you're willing to take action with no guarantee success, that is the mark of a leader. So you're courageous and courage is the mark of a leader. And that's what it takes. And we all have to realize there is no security in life, only opportunity. And so by taking the extra time to think, take some of these things into consideration, try to identify our goals, our weaknesses, our strengths, all these different things, then in only thing can we create things that are going to make the impossible possible. So, and then, and then as you're driving this train as an entrepreneur, is, is if you come to the resolve that I'm going to act as if it were impossible to, to fail, like it's impossible to fail. I'm going to keep going. I have to get through this. Uh, just, just act like way. Act like it's, it's impossible to fail, and you got to keep going and keep going and keep going. You'll figure it out. But don't try to do it alone. Get support of other people. Get support of knowledge. Get support of masterminds. Get support of our group, our community, that kind of stuff. And it should help with what you're doing. So a little exercise. Uh, what, what is it you can write down right now? What's an action that you could take based on what we just went through that you can like immediately, like tonight? Tomorrow, you can immediately take action that will that that will move things forward for you. Um, write that down right now. Very cool. So that is my short training on success mastery secrets. What did you guys think of that? Give me a little feedback. Let me know what you thought of that that feedback. And I did send you guys the slides, so uh, you should have the handouts you could have filled in. Okay, cool. I'll get some good feedback. They liked it. Great insights. Thank you. Excellent info. Thank you. All right, cool. So let me go through uh, a couple of just uh, tidy cleanup things and some stuff, cool stuff going on, and then I'm going to open up for questions, and we'll, 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 we'll let you guys ask whatever questions you have. So we're in the final uh, stages of launching uh, by Friday. We'll have our new Celebrity Lifestyle Brands website live, and I just wanted to give you guys a quick little peek. Um, it's featuring Christina Milian at first, and then we're going to have a slider here with Bert Dolman, Randy, and myself. And then we're going to go down, we're going to feature Chris Stoikas, who we're, we're uh, another one of our celebrities we're going to be working with uh, from the, the Dollar Beard Club. And then we have Celise Rose here. We're going to probably uh, switch this out with another celebrity. Um, but we're going to put some celebrities on here and kind of function out kind of a new site, kind of excited about it. I um, want to give you guys a little peek there. And I also want to show you that if you have not seen it already, we did launch and completely rebrand the T-Rex WP website, and that is all here. So you guys can be more than happy to check out the T-Rex WP website. Uh, that is all up and running. And one of the things by tomorrow morning, on the bottom of T-RexWP.com, there will be an affiliate link uh, for you to create an affiliate account as well as get your affiliate log into an affiliate area. So if you guys are interested in referring T-Rex to people and you want to get paid, um, the price for a done-for-you store is $1,497. And uh, for all of our customers like you, you can get your second store, third store, fourth store for $97. We did change our hosting model. Uh, we were going to charge $97 a month for the first site and then $47 a month for every site thereafter. 
we decided that you can go ahead and host up to three sites included in that $97. So we're, we're, uh, we're just going to, because most people aren't going to have more than three, three done for you stores. Uh, so we're just going to include that in the $97 a month hosting. And again, for those of you who maybe haven't heard about that or haven't heard me talk about that, uh, we, we've owned a number of software companies and we recognize that in order for a software company to grow, in order for a software company to continue to add value and to stay on top of its game, uh, we, we had to go with the reoccurring model because that revenue will allow us to continue to hire programmers and updates and plugins and fix things and add new things and that income will allow us to provide a better value proposition to you as opposed to the previous model where it was just a one-time fee. And I've seen hundreds of companies go out of business on that one-time fee because they didn't have the continued sales uh, of this of the platform to enable to keep building upon it. So pretty excited about the new T-Rex WordPress website and we also just had a new uh, oh, I don't I don't have it. Oh and by the way for those of you you know going back to what we were talking about a minute ago with goal setting and tasks this is a software program that we use called BizPad you can go get a free account here and you can do limited stuff with it for free and then it, and then it increases from there but this is what I use to run all of our businesses, all of our employees, all everything. I, I, I literally have hundreds of projects. I manage everybody in here. I hold people accountable. We transfer files back and forth, usernames and passwords. It basically maximizes your productivity, saves you time and money, systemizes your business, gets you organized. And so going back to the seven the success secrets, if you don't have a tool like this to help you keep things straight, I don't know how you can do it. So anyway, I know I want to share BizPad with you. And it's just B-I-Z-P-A-D dot com. Bizpad.com. Um, okay, so that's done. The affiliate program's coming. Um, I want to show you. So now, I want to show you. So we have a, a a young lady who's on with us, and if we have any questions, we can get her on board. Her name is Joanna Kinsman. <laughs> she invented these accessories uh, for women, and we put these up into my store, which is Inspiration by God. Uh, the kinney bands, the head wraps, um, sweatband type things, single headbands, all of these products are in our store. We can export these out of my store, put them into a theme pack, give them to you for free, wouldn't charge for you, and you can be and, and, and Joanna will drop ship these for you. So if you have the kind of store where you feel these kind of items would be something that you would like to market in your store. We're going. We will make that available to you, and Joanna will uh, drop ship all the products for you. They're really, really cool. The women love them. And in order to get a hold of Joanna, her email is. Let me get her email real quick. I'm going to put it in the chat box. So her email is orders at keenybands.com. I'll go ahead and put that in the chat box to everybody. So if you want to get the Keeney bands, all you have to do is send an email. She'll set you up with a vendor account, and then we'll get the export of all of the files, and you just import them into your T-Rex, and bam, you can add all these products to your store. I don't know how many SKUs there are, but I'm going to guess there's about 50 or 60. Um, and like I said, I, I, I'm one of these guys that think that when you have stuff like this and you have the women come in your store, if you have more product that's unique like this, it's, it, I would think it's going to increase your overall cart, your orders per, or your income per cart type thing. So, and if you have any questions, you can do that too. Okay, cool. So, Kevin, and if you love those, just, just email orders at uh, that, that, that email I just sent you, and Joanne, I will get you set up with, a, with a, a vendor agreement, and she'll drop ship everything for you, and she'll just, just be another vendor in your store. Okay, so that's uh, that's off my list. Let me look at my list here. New website, affiliate program. Okay, so I am excited that we are going to be launching and sharing this with you soon. Let me show you this. This is our big noggin. How do I go full screen with this? Window. I forget how to go full screen. Oh, right here. There we go. So this is the Big Noggin Funware Christmas Pack. So we did a little, uh, we did a little uh, pack for Halloween. Now we're coming out with a Christmas pack. 
and we should just kill it with this. This is very unique, very cool stuff, and I just can't imagine us not just killing it with this stuff. So we'll have this and email everybody tomorrow. You'll get the images. Um, you'll get you'll get everything, everything you need to basically be putting these on shirts and having us print these shirts out. So this is the actual designs. It's kind of showing kind of big here. Um, I actually grabbed the wrong PDF. This is just the designs. Let me grab the designs where they're on the kids. Well, now I went full screen. Now I can't get rid of it. How do I get rid of this thing? Uh, I'm seeing some questions on the price point for the Kini bands. And Joanna will send you a pricing sheet when you, you email orders at, and here I'll, I'll put it I'll put it in here to everybody too. Orders at KiniBands.com. Send to all. Okay, here, here's another PDF of the designs with kids in, in the kids. So let's go through these. These are so cute. I just think I just think these are gonna sell like crazy. Look at that. Let me shrink this a little bit. Look at that. I think these are gonna sell great. We're the only ones that have these. Nobody has anything like this. So we got to get these a try. And, and again, Sam Maxwell, our artist, did these. And the small amount of money that we we're asking you guys to invest in these, it'll be $197. Uh, just help support Sam to continue to create world-class designs that are unique for us, and, and nobody else has these things. Kiss me, it's Christmas. I like that one. Oh, he's right in the stocking. That's beautiful. Yeah, these will be 197 for the pack, and we'll get these uh, working and get them all organized so we can send you the files tomorrow. So that is the big noggin theme pack that's coming, and I, I'm I, I just Sam is an amazing individual, and he does some great stuff, and again we're getting some real cool creative stuff for us. Um, so that's the theme pack. We also are creating a theme pack store, where that that's gonna. I'm gonna. I don't. I, it didn't get finished today, but we're gonna have that soon, and you're gonna be able to see a store. You're gonna be able to go to the store, order different theme packs, and, and then import them into your store and get what you, what you get what you need there. So that's that. That's that. The big noggin. Okay, I I got one more thing I'm gonna talk to you about, and then and then we're gonna share that good news for you. That, that's gonna that's gonna be very good for you. See now, I don't know. I'm hitting escape and I cannot get this dang PDF window to to uh, to go away. That's weird. Um, so I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Ad Espresso, but I'm going to do a little training on Ad Espresso next week. I I find for my brain and the way I work and the way I function, um, I love this program. I run all my Facebook ads through this program. I love how it gives me charts and graphs. I love how I just love everything about the performance of showing me which ads are working, which ads are not working, the top ads, the worst ads. Um, I, I love everything about this program, and so I'm going to do a little training on this. So, if, for me, just using uh, let me pull up a campaign here. Uh, let's see here. For me. Um, I don't like the way just the interface of Facebook uh, ads is and Facebook Power Editor. I prefer something like this. I can go to my ads reporting. I can set up split tests super easy. I can set up, like I'm doing a split test on mobile right here, so I hit graph it. And it just gives me beautiful uh, charts and graphs on what's working and what's not. Uh, this one looks like, there we go. 
So again, you're looking down here, your desktop, right column, mobile, Instagram, how much I've spent. And again, I'm doing impressions and post page engagement engagement. And obviously Instagram is killing it for us here. Uh, but it is it, this this program, if you're not familiar with it, I'll do a training on it soon and show you guys what it's all about, see if you guys might want to check it out. Uh, I love Ad Espresso, I just love it. So with that being said, let's go ahead and open it up for questions. And if you have any questions, go ahead and type it in and uh, I'll, I'll get your question answered. So Dirk is asking what celebrities we have. We have some stuff that we're putting up for Christina Million. We're coming out some stuff with Chris Stoikos for the Dollar Beard Club. And we're also working on a package with Odell Beckham Jr. Uh, but it's, it seems to take longer than, than I ever expected to deal with the celebrities and the legal processes and stuff. But um, we are doing that. Oh, yeah, the good news, the good news. The good news for everybody. I forgot about that. This is very important. New pricing. So Randy decided he wanted to give everyone a Christmas present. And starting Friday through Christmas for like the next six weeks, he's dropping the price on T-shirts to six fifty and the mugs five fifty. So five fifty to six fifty. So all the prices are dropping on the T-shirts and the mugs. So that's going to give everybody the ability to make a lot more money. I thought it was very very generous of, of, of Randy to do that. So that's pretty exciting. Yes. So yeah, that that'll be going into effect on Friday. You won't have to do anything. It's, he's just gonna check. He's gonna have his accounting department change the pricing and just you know, every single T Rex customer. And it's only for T Rex customers, by the way. If you're not a T Rex customer, you don't get that pricing. Um, which everyone on here should be a T Rex customer. So um, that's what that. Yeah, thank you for that, Stephen. Yeah, and I think Derek. Well, you can ask Matt. I'm not sure about him updating. I'm sure I, I, he did get the that that spreadsheet from Randy. So I'm assuming that they'll update it wherever they need to update. I'm still a little bit learning on all the systems and what happens as well. And Kevin's asking how how will celebrity brand products work? Kevin, we're not 100% sure, but here's what here's what our goal is. Our goal is we sign a celebrity. We get you some celebrity branded product that you can market in your store, and so you can try to use that le that that leverage you know celebrity to drive traffic to your store, make some sales, hopefully sell some products for our our celebrities and what we're doing with celebrities, as well as get extra orders for your store. So maybe you have a section or a category in your store, celebrities, or uh, I guess it might be different for everybody's, but that's kind of the goal. The goal is that we you guys help us drive traffic and, and brand awareness and sales for celebrities and then we get more and more celebrities and so it makes it, you know, if bigger celebrities, the bigger the brand. But ex exactly how it's going to work, I'm not 100% sure. I mean, other than just what I said. We're still working through it and I'm kind of, it's kind of new to me. Everyone's saying thanks, Randy. Randy's actually driving. He's going to Ken Vitito's event. So he's on the road. He couldn't make it for today. And, and and Joanne is asking, is it for white tees or for both white and colored? It's for white and colored. You're getting you're getting the the tees are being lowered on, on the colored tees as well. Kevin's asking a really good question. Kevin, yes, we are gonna add phone cases. We are working on sweatpants, we're all we're also working on leggings and posters, all of that. I mean that that's as part of me coming in and celebrity lifestyle brands acquiring T-Rex and charging the, the, the continuity fee and all that kind of stuff, we are going to take this money and invest it in additional products that can help increase our sales for everybody. So, matter of fact, Randy was here in San Diego last week and we spent hours talking about this and talking about how much capital investment we have to make to invest in uh, various machines to do cell phone cases, for instance. Like, I want to do cell phone cases immediately. So yeah, we're going to be doing cell phone cases and 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 stuff like with Kini bands. I want to continue to add uh, products to our product mix so we have more of an e-commerce store and we can you know the more I think I think the more products you have in the store for an applicable audience, the more income you should make. I'm not I'm not a, I don't have any proof of that because I'm new to the e-commerce world, but it sounds logical to me. 
How does the big noggin design look on large adult shirts, or does it work better for children's sizes? Actually, Joanne, it looks really good on, on adult shirts. Uh, Randy actually printed some up on adult shirts, and depending on how big the adult shirt is, it might be a little small and look a little funny, but they're designed to look funny anyway. So they will go on adult shirts, for sure. Yeah, Larry's asking, can we put together a document sharing the changes from the T-Rex takeover? And hey, Larry, real quick, really, really, to me, what the simple thing is, is that one is we're hosting everything on our servers. We're not allowing anyone to buy the plugin anymore because Ken had told me and, and, and Dwight had told me they had a lot of support issues with various hosts. And so we said and to, to eliminate you know customer service and support issues for now, everybody's being hosted on our servers and that way we can maintain the integrity of the servers the speed of the servers all that kind of stuff and then two um, we have the done for you's we have the college warehouse that we launched we have the school zone that we launched we have the families and grandmas which you guys knew about and then we have the, the mugs galore so now we have those done for you's and we're going to continue to come out with new done for you packages and we're going to continue to optimize and systemize the idea that you can import products into your store fairly easily and the other thing is just the hosting plan uh, instead of charging a one-time fee like they did in the past for T-Rex um, we're doing the hosting fee as part of that and so for you site is 497 for all customers if you want just a blank install site it's a hundred a hundred dollar setup fee and then ninety seven dollars but again that hosting fee will include at least three sites for the hosting fee so that's pretty much it um, and I, I, you know, if you want to Facebook me or if you have any other questions, you could do that as well. Now, the question with the survey software included with the small NCA stores. So everybody who gets on one of our hosted, they're going to get the survey, they're going to get the plug-in, they're going to get everything, right? So we're not going to nickel and dime you on the different plugins and those things as long as you're a subscriber. And we're also kind of kind of considering the subscription, our membership, and our training. We're going to reamp and, and, and make better training, continue to make training, and do stuff like I'm doing today. We want to continue to add the training value. So to me, it's part of the membership, it's part of the community, and it's the hosting, and it's the upgrade. So it's all of the above. So you're going to get all that stuff. Uh, no, so so Kenneth is asking, are you saying you're ending support of the plugin? No, we're going to continue to do support, but what we didn't want to do, being we're the new owners, I didn't want to go sell 50 or 100 or 500 people the plugin and then be barraged with calls that this isn't working with my host and this, this PHP setting's not working and that's not working. No, we're going to continue to support all of our customers, but we're just not selling the plugin as a plugin to other people. We're forcing people to host their new sites on our servers. Now eventually, once we kind of get up and going, we get acclimated, we increase the team. The team needs to be increased. Uh, everyone's working very long hours. We will we will um, probably offer that plug-in and, and, and you know, we have to decide. I mean, we're doing what I taught today. We're doing a lot of that. Like we have to decide, do we want to go sell 20,000 plugins and compete with a Shopify or do we want to, you know, what do we want to do? So uh, we're, we're going through the same process that any business would go through with growth and we do know that we have to take care of you our customers or we don't have a business so we want to do that if you got any other questions I see we're getting we're getting we're getting down to I don't see any more questions coming in yeah no Kenneth you're right no, we're not pulling the plugins, and and uh, and actually, we're 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 working on some other acquisitions of technology and stuff that will work good with T Rex. And you know, with our investment banking background, both myself and Ed Bracken and Jeff Chatfield, who you guys will meet, they're going to be more and more visible to you guys. Um, you know, we, we're 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 all about acquiring things and doing things that are going to increase value for everybody. So you'll see a lot of that kind of stuff. And Joanne's asking if we have the big black mugs. You know, I don't know about the big black mugs. Um, Joanna, I, I, I don't know the answer to that question. My suggestion would be email support at trxwp.com and somebody will get you an answer to that. 
Yeah, and Kevin's asking about the NCAA stuff on products. I am not familiar with that. I do know that we're very restricted on with the AG fan shop that you cannot have other products in there. On the college warehouse, I think we are going to have other products in there. So, but I, I, I got to, I got to defer to Randy. I am staying out of the college thing, and we're trying to get delegate, uh, delegate things and and roles, and responsibilities, and Randy and Michael Tranter. They're handling all the college stuff. I really don't know. Yeah, sweatpants. We need sweatpants, and uh, I do want to get sweatpants for us. So, oh, and then Joyce says Randy does have black mugs. And Peter says, what sales volume do we need to qualify for Joanna's products? Um, I don't think you need any sales volume. She's got inventory, and she'll ship one for you. She'll ship ten for you. She just wants some distribution. She's been a great friend of mine. She's been there for me. She's worked for me in the past, and I want to do everything I can to help her. She deserves uh, to get her product out there. She's worked super hard and super long at it, and uh, I just want to do everything we can to help her. So I'd love to get you know, hundreds of T-Rex users to get Joanna's product on her site and she can sell lots of product so I mean she's she's a, a young girl here in Southern California doing it right she's like an entrepreneur you know, starting her own business and doing everything so it's be awesome uh oh she says she has standards that they she has to approve different things has to be a fit she wants she wants it to fit with what you're doing so and if you email her, she can get in communication with you and, and answer those questions and do that kind of stuff. You're welcome. All right, how about any more questions? I don't see any. I, I, if I missed a question, maybe you got to type it again because it's been scrolling for a while. But if I did miss your question, maybe you could type it again. If not, let me know if you have any more questions. Yeah, here, let me do this. So I'm going to go catalog, Kini Bands, catalog. I will send you this link on my store. So when I send this to everybody, does everybody get that link? I'm not sure how that works. There is a chat box better. Okay, I guess you got it. Okay, and then her email again was orders at k i n i b a n d s dot com. And then if you Google Kini Bands, K I N I, you'll see her site come up, and she also has a swimsuit line that she's created. That now this isn't the time of year for that, but maybe next year. But she's just an amazing entrepreneur. I'm t she's I'm typing these links into the question box. And I'm hitting reply all or send all. And I'm going to put it in the uh, chat box if I can find that. I don't even see the chat box. I don't know what's different between the chat box and the question box. Here, here I'll put it in the chat box. And then it's orders at k i n i b a n d s dot com. So you can check the chat box as well. Oops, I'm sorry, she got it. Yeah, you guys, if you don't have access to our new membership site, uh, here, let me show you that too. So that's another software company that we own. Um, it's called Value Add-on, and it's one of the top uh, membership platforms out there in the country, in my opinion. My son created it, so I'm very, very biased. Uh, oh, wrong one. Let me log in here. So I'm a manager on the site, but it looks like this. So if you don't have access to this site with the training courses organized like this, um, email support 
at trxwp.com and Matthew will get you an account set up. So everyone should get access to this. You should have been added. And you know what? More than likely you were added. And if you go to uh, members.trexwp.com, I'll put this in here, and you hit forgot password or even Google your email for it, we send everybody a username and password, but it's been a while. So did you guys get those links? Oh, Dirk, Dirk's asking, when will the remaining videos for training be completed? I don't know if they'll ever be completed. We're just going to keep adding and adding and adding, you know, for different things. Like like right now, I want to do some training on that trust message thing and how to use trust message. And I, mean, I want some better training on uh, how to use that uh, survey plug-in. Um, so we're going to continue to keep you know, see, we got plug-in features training, basic install training, full done for you install training. We're trying to really get it sequential and put it in a place to where, depending on where you're at, what you're doing, and I'm trying to make the lessons short and sweet and defined properly so you don't have to go through an hour video to find one little thing you need to set up. So you log in here, and then if there's something that we're missing, create a support ticket. You can hit the contact button and, and come right to our support desk and make a support ticket, and then we'll get those videos created for you. I mean, this is crucial that we provide the proper training. And so if we're missing something and you tell us what it is, we'll get it done. We'll get that training created for you. Basic install videos are not there yet. Let's see. You know, I'm looking at them right here. And you know what? They might not have been there two hours ago or yesterday. So email for support is support at trexwp.com. Oh, you're saying if I tap on a lesson there, oh, I see what you're saying, coming soon, gotcha. Yeah, so that's what Matthew did is he laid out the whole course. Now he's got to start creating the training. Oh, it's coming. It's on Matthew's list. So we got to, we got to get that going for you. <laughs> Thanks for bringing it to my attention, Dirk. Adam is asking uh, the longtime members being added over to the new membership site. We added everyone to the new membership site. Everybody, every, all T-Rex customers have been added. Um, like I can just get and go here to users, and I can just look you up, Adam. I can just go Adam, A-D-A-M, and I don't see you in here. So um, maybe you're on a list that we didn't get. Because we did import like 1,100 people in here, so everybody should have got a username and password to this site. But again, if you didn't, just email support at trexwp.com and Matthew will get you added in here. You get immediate access. Okay, yeah, sorry about that. I'm not, that makes me, uh, I got to figure out why, why that happened. I don't, I don't get it. Yeah, just, just email support. Matthew will get you a link to where you can click and create your account. Or he'll just add you and you'll get an email with the username and password. Yeah, Kevin, the question to your answer on the hosting is, yeah, what I want to do is up to three sites for the for the for the well, it's 97 a month, but for the old customers, it's 47 a month. So, yeah, three sites for 47 a month. We're trying to, you know, you, we got this complicated situation where you have these old T-Rex, and you have the T-Rex plug-in, you have the, 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 the T-Rex Extreme, and then the new done for use. So we're just trying to, to be fair to everybody. But, yeah, we, we'll, we'll work that out, Kevin. Just email support, and Matthew will take care of you. He's got instructions for me to take care of everybody. Cool. Okay, everybody. Well, I got about 55 minutes. So that's a that's a good hour for us. I sure appreciate your time. I appreciate you. We appreciate your business. Uh, 
keep keep up the good work and 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 I'll keep an eye out oh we are going to do another webinar on Friday on that video remix did anybody that it uh, does anyone have an interest in getting uh, that video remix that the, the, I don't know if you've even seen are you, are you guys familiar with the video remix Hank said he bought it um, anyway we're going to do a webinar on video remix and they're going to do some training for us and uh, and 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 I'm I'm I got an today I bought it today and I, and I just think it's an awesome program for what we're doing so um, and then I'm getting them to get us some uh, as part of what I'm negotiating with them is we're going to get some pre-done templates that we can share with all the T-Rex people so it looks like a bunch of people bought it already so um, okay so um, excellent product cool alright we're going to do that Friday so look for an email for that and uh, We'll see you guys in the community and Facebook. Thank you, everybody. Talk to you guys soon.